okay for the post we have the title we will have the title of the post and then we will have uh, let's remove this page it comes everywhere it will not look good if we have page then we will appear the page okay we don't need it first we will have the title of our uh, post then we will have a separator and then we will have the site name awesome it will look good if you wanna have the uh, meta description template for your post and I will uh, recommend you to keep it uh, empty okay because we will have the description of our uh, actual post that we will write okay so keep it empty okay keep uh, keep this as it is too don't check this out because we want uh, the search engines to in, uh, index and follow our posts okay show data in snippet preview for example uh, on Facebook you can see there will be some results where there will be the date okay see this three days ago and let me see some other results for example if we search uh, health for example you can see there will be some posts where there will be the date let me see if, if we have uh, no result with the date but sometimes we see the date before the description right here okay just like I, saw, uh, I just showed you three days ago let me see if we have here uh, no let's search something else let's search Twitter maybe we see the date here see one hour ago 19 hours ago this time and this is basically the time and date okay so uh, I recommend you to keep this checked okay because people know that how when your post was po when uh, your content was posted okay so it depends on you if you want or not but I always check this okay show date in snippet preview okay now we have the SEO for our pages how our pages will uh, behave in the search engine first we will have the title of the page then we will have the separator and then we will have the site name awesome no description I recommend you to do to uh, write okay show date in snippet preview then we have media media for example we have pictures and uh, uh, with some videos on our uh, blog and then how search engine will handle it we will do we will uh, set up here okay so first we will have the title of the media and then we will have the separator and then we will have the site name keep this empty and check this out and make sure you click on save changes okay now let's go to taxonomies and let me tell you that uh, what these will do okay these are the categories tags and formats we don't want the search engine to uh, uh, to show this in the search results nobody wants okay so always click on no index just follow okay no index follow no index follow J uh, just keep them as it is and save changes keep taxonomies as it is now let's talk about the archives okay archives uh, there are uh, I think no blogger wants the archives to show on the search uh, results what are archives are archives are basically the for example archives are basically you can say this technology is basically the category when we open it we see our post related to technology that will be our archive okay like I have shown you when we set up our Sahifa when we make the settings of our Sahifa theme I showed you what archive is so that is the archive if you still have problem what archive is you can ask me okay but let me uh, tell you again what archive is archive is basically the uh, category where we see all of our posts okay for example if I click on technology we will see post related to technology but we don't have any post right now if I click on health we will see post related to the health so this will be our archive we don't want the search engines to uh, to uh, to follow or index our archives so what you can do here disable the date based archives disable the author archives okay I always does it but if you if you want the uh, if you want the search engine to follow you can always uncheck it okay so I'm gonna save changes keep these as, as it is okay everything now it, there's another tab other so uh, I recommend you to keep at as it is okay it is the best setting we have right now all right we are done so let's click on the social here now we are done with the general titles and now let's talk, let's talk about this social now you can link your blog with your Facebook Twitter Pinterest Google Plus accounts it is 
very important for SEO and I do recommend you to do it okay then when you will search your blog on Google Google knows that you exist on Facebook Twitter Pinterest Google Plus so Google will rank you good rank you higher okay so always provide your provide your profiles here okay MySpace profile Facebook YouTube Google Plus all these so if I if we go to Facebook we can edit more settings about the Facebook for example we if we if you want to share the picture what kind of image you want title you want description you want but uh, I want you to keep this empty because we will do on the post that we want to write okay we will optimize it for the for everything for Facebook Twitter Pinterest so keep these settings as it is okay but you can uh, also make uh, also uh, fill these settings up if you want these are basically the title description and image used in the open graph meta text in the front of your site okay this whenever someone shares your site what image will appear image will appear that you upload here right here okay title will appear that is right here description will appear that is right here but don't uh, update it because we have just done in the general okay we have just updated the setting of for our website so you don't need to write extra settings for especially Facebook but if you want when someone shares your post or your especially website not post especially website when someone shows your uh, shares your website what information you want to be on the Facebook you can provide here but if you keep these empty your general information that we just write on the general tab let me open this this right here okay this uh, oops not this titles and metas the information that we just write here this site name and everything that we just wrote that information will appear okay site name title of the site and description of the site that we just write okay these information will appear by default but if you want a special information to appear you can write those settings here Facebook for the Twitter for Pinterest for the special settings okay so I hope you guys got the idea what we can do in social so we have some other advanced settings uh, and I recommend you to keep these settings as it is we only need these three important settings to be changed okay and we are done with these settings and you guys know how to use this SEO plugin so thank you guys for watching this video in the next video I will show you that how we can optimize our post for the best SEO okay so thank you for watching this video I will see you in the next video